Today I'm going to show you how to access our subscription of New York Times online. Go to printergasslibrary.org and scroll down until you find the button that says access the New York Times. Click there. It is going to take you to this page. Scroll down until you see where it says in the library or remote access. If you are in the library, click on the word here. And then you're going to create your free account. If you have a Google account, you can use that, or you can use your Facebook account or your Apple account. If you don't want to use any of these for your account, you can use an email address and password. Once you type those in, you're going to click on create account. If you already have an account with the New York Times, just click on login and put in your email address and password. Once you log in, it is going to take you to the front page of the New York Times. And now, you can click and read as many articles as you want for free. If you do not have an account with the New York Times or don't use our free access to the New York Times, New York Times only lets you read up to five articles per month for free before they put up a paywall. If you are not in the library and you would like to access our New York Times account, under where it says remote access, you're going to click here and it's going to give you a digital code to access the New York Times. Click Redeem. And once again, you will have to either create an account or sign in with your account. Once you sign in, it'll show you this page letting you know the code is valid, what kind of access you have, and how long you have. These codes are for 72 hours at a time. And then you can click Continue. And once again, and now you can read the New York Times for free for 72 hours. After that 72 hours, if you would like to access the New York Times again when you're not in the library, you can redeem an additional code. As always, if you ever have any questions, you can contact us at the James Prendergast Library by emailing, calling, or stopping in.